Focus everyone's attention over here, please. Over this way. The door. Come, come. Is this the work here on the wall? No, that's Scott. Uh -huh. uh, would you like to talk about this one or any one particular? Okay, so you went out. I'll repeat everything you say so you don't have to shout. Okay? I'm sure that is Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> this is the center right of attention. Um, Frida Howling is an artist that I met about two years ago or so, and she's a resident of, of Conne uh, Stratford, Connecticut, and I would say she's a significant mid-20th century artist. Um, she talks about her work and she says that nature is the primary focus of my work. Sometimes the awesome forces of nature, other times the tranquility of nature. I see the environment as forms occupying space. My abstract shapes draw their strength from the firm basis in the natural forms of the landscapes. The artist, himself, the artist has a privilege to translate nature's forms into various moods which will affect the inner and spiritual emotions of the viewer. I think that's a very beautiful statement. So her work you'll see is, uh, has an abstract um, base but also has also a naturalistic expression and her her color palette also is very vivid and beautiful greens yellows uh, working in many different materials this is paint on uh, it's called multi um, media on metal um, gorge is in the window the one um, it's called natural meadow uh, nature's meadow yeah. and also a very whimsical painting of the subway window there so I'm um, very, very proud to have your work Thank you. uh, yeah, with us. Thank you, Thank you Frida. Do you have anything to add? I'll repeat. No, I just want to say this lady opened the, this gallery. <laughs> this lady is Arlene Jacoby, who is founder actually of Riva, Riva Gallery of Riva and um, so I was very fortunate to have our spiritual mother that's right so thank you for thank you for mentioning that and I was fortunate to um, be in contact with Riva myself through my very dear friend Valerio Boborello who I met in 1986 at the Metropolitan Museum and he's uh, uh, from Bucharest Romania where he was um, a teacher uh, actually, he was chair of painting at the uh, Grigorescu Academy of, of uh, Fine Art there before, he, uh, before he left or escaped from Ceausescu's <laughs> Romania, that's what we said. So okay. I'm very proud of that. Right. Very, okay. Quite an eclectic uh, group here at Riva. So thank you. Thank you.